Sheriff's deputies detained the individuals, uh, pushed them out of the area, and gave them a warning that future behavior would result in prosecution for violating our camping ban. Vista's mayor and sheriff's deputies spent part of the day notifying people living on the streets they can't be there anymore. The city approved enforcement of a homeless encampment ban two days ago. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell spoke with the mayor about why he says enforcement is necessary and what happens to people who violate the ban. With a team of sheriff's deputies, Vista Mayor John Franklin visited homeless encampments in the city Thursday morning. This is video he shot of their interaction with those living there. We've blurred people's faces because they're not accused of any crime. Sheriff's deputies detained the individuals, uh, pushed them out of the area, and gave them a warning that future behavior would result in prosecution for violating our camping ban. This happening just two days after the city council voted to uphold the city's encampment ban. Franklin says he still believes this type of enforcement is needed to help those living on the streets. Those are the three options. Live in a ravine like they're doing behind me, go to the shelter or go to jail. There are no other options. But here's where things get tricky. The city of Vista doesn't have its own police force. It contracts with the San Diego County Sheriff's Office. We reached out to the Sheriff's Office about their stance on this enforcement, and we were given this statement, which reads in part, no one will go to jail for simply sleeping on the street. Violation of the encampment ban is not a bookable offense and will generally result in a citation. 